Hi guys. Now, for subtopic 2.7, you will learn about the safety features in vehicles. Now, what I have uh, in front of you over here is three most basic safety features in vehicles. Now, this I have already taught you over here in inertia and I'm going to repeat it one more time. Now, seat belts, as you can see, it prevents the driver or passenger over here from being thrown forward. So, the keywords over here prevent the driver or passenger from being thrown forward and this is over here due to inertia now when you talk about headrest now just to make sure over here you still can remember now when you talk about headrest your car this one in black over here is not moving now another car at the back now you are inside this car okay you are inside the black car now this red car over here collides with your car now what happens over here without a headrest your body and your neck mostly your neck will tend to move backwards a lot Okay, now when your neck tends to move backwards a lot, you will have neck injuries. In certain cases, it's fatal, dangerous. So what happens over here is, we use a headrest so that your neck and your body can move together. That's the reason why you're using a headrest. Again, guys, I'm telling you, your neck and your body over here can move together. That's why you're over here having a headrest. So in the characteristics of it, you can write prevents neck injuries. Okay, during a sudden collision until or when the car is stationary. All right. Now, for airbag over here, all of you all, like, hopefully you've seen an airbag before, inflates automatically. Inflates means buka lah. Inflates automatically and acts as a cushion over here to prevent head and body injuries. INJ stands for injuries, guys. Okay. These are the basic ones. Now, after this, I'm going to talk about a little bit more difficult concepts. Huh? 